Welcome to Sitting and Thinking About God. These are daily devotions written by a great man and a really cool minister who was a shepherd. Happened to be my father, Dan Burke, Community Christian Church in Illinois. This is a dude who chose to live by learning and he then chose to impart that wisdom into others during his final days of breath on this earth as read to you by his young son. And this one is entitled, Believer's Christmas. It's apparently it's a Christmas episode. We're all doing reruns during quarantine here, people. I was young, 20, and I needed the money. So off to Santa school I went. Apparently I impressed all of the Santa school instructors. No, they weren't elves. Because they chose me to be the first Santa at the new mall in Lansing, Michigan. And since reindeer were a little pricey, I rode in on a helicopter. Television cameras and bunches of children were there to greet Santa by the hundreds. They saw the child with his mother Mary, and they bowed down and worshipped him. Then they opened their treasures and presented him with gifts of gold and incense and, and of myrrh. Matthew 2, 11. Santa <laughs> and a helicopter is an incredible sight for a believing child. Can you imagine? But I never really found that to be any real competition as we were as, as the way we raised our boys. Daily talk about Jesus and time together as we talked to Christ was much more impressive to our children and far more believable than anything the local mall was able to do. Father, Jesus, fill my boys' hearts. Lord, I will never know a better Christmas gift. Thank you. Amen. His Dan. Okay, postscript to the Christmas episode here. Here's what he left out. Okay, as the story goes, so my father is dressed as Santa Claus and flying in a helicopter, going to this the new opening of the mall in Lansing, Michigan. Thousands of kids there, right? It's a big event in the 70s. So they're flying him up there, and as they're going in the helicopter, he realizes two things. One, he's got motion sickness, and two, he hates heights. So he said, uh-oh, we're in trouble, Prancer. So they bring him down, they land, you got thousands of kids, and my dad gets steps out, not my dad, Santa Claus steps out of the helicopter wobbly, and the parents are like bringing their kids back a little bit, and the next thing you know, Santa Claus pukes all over his beard, all down his the red turns different colors, and you got a thousand kids and parents out there going, ah, oh! <laughs> they rushed rush him back in the helicopter, They're like, what's that going to do? So they had to clean him up, and uh, I don't think anyone sat on his lap that day. Thank you.